Hey everybody, I'm Dave Lewick, the Trapper Guy. I'm a nuisance wildlife trapper in the Tampa Bay area of Florida. And today I'm talking about five amazing facts about Eastern Diamondback rattlesnakes. Now the Eastern Diamondback Rattlesnake is the largest snake in North America. It's not the longest, the Eastern Indigo is the longest snake, but it's definitely the largest as far as the mass of it, the weight. They're very huge snakes. They can get up to, the record is 8 foot, but a very large one would be 7 foot, which if you see this one right here, I caught that about 10 years ago in Tampa. You've probably seen on the internet about the 15 foot rattlesnakes. Those are a hoax, and I talk about that below on my website, and I have a link to that in the description. Now, the next amazing thing about Eastern Diamondback rattlesnakes is that they are pit vipers. And what this means is on the front of their face, underneath their nostrils, they have heat-seeking pits. And what these do is they allow them to find their prey, which is usually warm-blooded animals, even in the dark. Now the third and probably most amazing fact about Eastern Diamondback rattlesnakes is they're not aggressive. I've been around, I can't count how many Eastern Diamondback rattlesnakes and they're usually pretty pissed off by the time I get there because the customers have a bunch of neighbors there, dogs are barking, they want me to catch it and relocate it. Never once have I been charged by an Eastern Diamondback rattlesnake. They will sit there and aggressively defend themselves but they're not going to come after you. So the best thing to do is if you see one out in the wild, turn around and walk away and I guarantee you they won't come after you. If you have one in your yard, you got small kids or pets and you're worried about it, it's probably best to call a professional to come out and deal with it. You don't really want to go up and mess with it yourself because it's going to be a really expensive and really dangerous and possibly deadly if you accidentally get bit. Now just because the Eastern Diamondback Rattlesnake is not an aggressive snake, it doesn't mean it's not a dangerous snake. In fact, it's the most dangerous venomous snake in North America. A lot of people that don't heed its warning, they try to kill it with a shovel or shoo it away with a rake, and they don't realize that snake can strike out to two-thirds of its body distance and it's near one inch long fangs injects a lot more hemotoxic venom than other types of pit vipers. Now the last amazing thing about Eastern Diamondback rattlesnakes is although they're known as ground dwelling or terrestrial snakes and they're often associated with things like gopher tortoise holes which are on the ground, rattlesnakes can swim and you often will find them on intercoastal waterways in the Tampa Bay area even out in the salt water and also they can climb. I was on a job once where a customer called me out and they saw a rattlesnake in the backyard on the ground and as I'm walking around all of a sudden I am uh, face to face with the eastern diamondback that climbed up a trellis. So make sure you're aware of all your surroundings and not just looking at the ground. But anyhow if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you know when the new videos come out.